nice to be in the shop. No rocks to put my knees into. Get to sit on the stool and take this off. Like it was made for it. Here we go. <laughs> happening that's a pretty good impact wrench and uh, no way it didn't touch it <laughs> oh, oh man <laughs> what have I gotten myself into Okay. Cheater pipe. Something gave, but it wasn't a nut. Yeah. Huh. Ah. <laughs> uh. It was the nut. We got little chrome pieces all over. I thought that I shattered something, but it didn't. It was just the nut giving loose. <laughs> what 
the crap. Nothing to it. Except everything I got, I guess. Figured I'd get you up under here before I uh, start getting this all taken apart, but you can kind of see all the way down this rail how really relatively crud free all the underside is. Um, of course, short of that underside of the pumpkin. Not sure it's going to be fun, but the rest of this just kind of hit with a the wire brush and uh, clean it up a little bit. It'll be ready for paint now. That's going to be a different story up here with those cross members. I can just see from here all the crud under there. Would have been nice to do outside, but there's just no way I couldn't lay on those rocks. So this is it. As I suspected, it's pretty rough in here. So I went and picked up a little brush for the drill. I'm going to try that out. See how that does. Forgot to take the sway bar off. That one's actually. She's loosened up. Let's see what happens. I wonder if anything will with the other side still hooked up. Not a thing. So. Hmm. Actually, I didn't have anything to do with the other side because that shackle should. Uh. Be allowed to drop now. I think I'm gonna have to 
use a persuader on it. Pipe. think it through a little bit. What I had that was handy. I wonder if I'm missing something. Not doing a thing. Definitely missing my tanker bar in this situation. You know, those five foot spuds. I got nothing. How how is it hanging on there? It's not even it's like it's still bolted or something. shock bracket. I don't really want to be under it if I can hit it. Okay, so I was prying the axle against this bracket, and uh, then I looked, and that's welded to the axle, so you gotta get underneath it is the issue. welded to it. I don't know. No, that's still riveted to the control arm. What is the deal? Well, I've said before that working on this truck is reminiscent of working on a tank. I gotta say, having the cheater pipe on there, breaking that loose reminded me of breaking track. And, uh, you know, just beating things with a full size sledgehammer. Also, However, not being 20 years old anymore, this is uh, not going my way. Whereas I can always make it happen with the tank. I got nothing. I think I might see error through the top. 
I don't think I am. I think that's just imagination. I am not budging this at all. At this point, I gotta start questioning if the juice is worth the squeeze. And you can make it out in there. Light's a little too bright. But, you know, there's definitely a bit of, uh, you know, dry rot or whatever that, oh, there's the side of it right here. That's not a pretty looking bushing, but I don't know. Does it squeak? I, I, you know, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I can get it off. That's what I'm trying to say. And uh, it's the only two things I'm not able to get to so far. Oh, man. Tendinitis in my elbow is really kicking in now, too. I don't know. So this was kind of interesting. While I'm waiting, I uh, sprayed that uh, shackle down with some penetrating oil. While I'm waiting, I decided I'd kind of get back to some color questions that I've had for a long time. I started <clears throat> last year cleaning this bell housing up a little bit, and you can see there's definitely different colors here. Orange and a redder orange. And um, what it turns out is as I hit this with the wire brush, it actually turns to this redder orange. So this is some odd fading that occurs, apparently, with it. And uh, I don't know if we can make that out on here or not, but it's definitely a red, a more red color, which should be the original. <clears throat> this is what everyone is using because... Uh, orange came later and was Chevy. So this red was particularly for uh, GMC. This wasn't the original color. That's long since gone. Uh, no, no one has the code for it because it was an engine paint. But <clears throat> this is actually Ford 1605. And even though it's Ford, this is what they're saying is the closest to the original color. So I figured I'd leave as much as I could of the original on here and maybe just spray a little on the side of it or next to it and see um, what it looks like, how close it is. Well, it didn't go on very good, but I didn't really spend a lot of time prepping it. But you can definitely see the color. And that's pretty decent. I don't know how that'll come out on camera, but that looks like that's right. They did a pretty good job identifying that, I would say. All right, that's what I'm going with. You got the valve cover too. Now that could, I don't know, I was going to say maybe has been repainted, but probably not as that looks like just one layer. But <clears throat> it definitely looks more orangey. I don't know how that looks. But, <clears throat> but again, that fading seems to turn it orange. I mean, this is really orange right here. So it could just be that. Yeah, not sure how clear this is going to come out. But this is paint, the paint, the new stuff right in here. And if you can make it out right in that little spot right there is the old paint. And you really can't even tell the difference. It is, it is very close. I like it.
Well, that's all I've got. She ain't coming. So whether I think it needs it or not, those bushings are staying in there. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I don't know what. <clears throat> I'm going to look up some videos probably this week. I mean, it's sitting here, so it's not going anywhere. I'll just leave the nuts loose for now and um you know do a little research but i mean it's just uh it's a physics issue at this point there's nothing you know if somebody's got any tricks or something i suppose i could try it but if you think maybe that you know i didn't give it all the effort that i should or maybe i left something on the table leave a comment and i'll block you so i'm I'm a goner. That's all I got. <laughs>